Oh my goodness, are we overdue a catch up? Grab a drink or a snack or whatever you want and we'll sit down and have a little catch up, okay? I haven't been speaking to you properly here on my channel um, in one of my vlogs since my last one that I posted, which was our engagement vlog, which was such a gorgeous video to post. I had so much fun editing it. Because we got back in the middle of January, I almost felt like two weeks of absolute overwhelm trying to get like back into the swing of things. There was lots of like projects to get started on, a new element of like wedding planning and organizing that we wanted to get started with. And it was all kind of overwhelming I won't lie it is now the beginning of February I feel so much calmer I feel back into the routine I'm back doing all my morning walks with Remy eating healthy I'm back going to Pilates I definitely feel a lot more settled and calmer um in the past like two weeks which is really really nice I wanted to start this vlog with a little bit of a catch-up because I feel like I haven't sat down and properly spoken to you in honestly it feels like ages one of the questions that I keep getting is about the wedding planning and like what the plan is what's happening so yes some of the planning has started already and I will be taking you guys along with me during that which I'm so excited about because I think it's going to be such a fun journey. One of the first things on the agenda is to pick out our engagement ring which I'm so excited about. I say our engagement ring but really it's my engagement ring and I'm absolutely buzzing. Um, Yosef proposed with the most beautiful token ring. It's a gold, can you see here? It's a gold clatter ring with an opal in the heart which is just so personal and so thoughtful. I actually didn't know this but the opal is the official stone of Australia which is so sweet Um, and it's such a special ring. So we are going to pick out a ring which I'm so excited about so I think I might save that for a separate video because we actually have like a try on viewing booked later this week and I think I'm just gonna put that in a separate video and take you along because I'm actually so excited. I kind of have an idea of what I want and I've been doing so much research on the different types of rings, types of diamonds, all that kind of stuff and I am just so excited and I feel like that will be a very interesting video in itself so stay tuned for that. And then the first part of the wedding planning that we're looking at now is locking in our venue and I know for some people they kind of like to take a little bit of a break after the engagement but for both of us we're kind of keen to get our date locked in because we have a specific date in mind that we're really, really excited about that we think will be perfect. Um, so once again, I'll leave that for another video because I want to tell you about it when it's booked and I feel like it could be booked very soon. So rest assured, as soon as we have it nailed down, I will tell you all about it. Since I've been home, it has been such a fun few weeks of not just getting back to work and getting back into the swing of things, but there's been some really, really fun events and little trips and catch ups with people. And it's just been so, so nice. I went on the most gorgeous little Irish staycation to Glass and Lake House in Athlone. Um, that was last week. And I'm going to insert some clips from that trip because it was so much fun. <laughs> just gotten into our room at Glassen and look cute it is. I love these pictures on the wall. I've been seeing this kind of style throughout the whole hotel. Oh my god. So they've left me a welcome pack. We have some salted caramel popcorn. <gasps> What's this? Oh my god is that a dog? Oh my god that's a dog collar and leash. I do know that Glassen is dog friendly which is absolutely amazing and uh, we've got our itinerary. This is by Mysa Lavender Organic Handcrafted Salts. And I know this brand well. Skelligs do the most incredible chocolate. I've tried these truffles before. They're amazing. Oh my God, I feel so spoiled. I love all the little details. They've got a vinyl player. There's a gorgeous little mini Smeg fridge. Look at this little bar. Oh my God, this is amazing. I'll show you the bathrooms as well. The bathrooms are so beautiful. Oh my goodness and a gorgeous shower. Oh, so excited. Okay, so I actually need to head down because we are going to jump in the hot tub for a nice little evening soak after our treatment. We're here for the launch of the Brooks & Co Spa and it is 
probably one of the most stunning spas I've ever seen. Like the most beautiful treatment room. It's so, so pretty. I had a lymphatic drainage massage. It was so nice. And then now I'm gonna head down to the hot tub and actually I should put on my swimming togs and leave because I don't wanna be late. Right, so I have a few minutes to spare. I've popped on a shower cap because we're going down into the hot tubs and it may snow and I don't wanna get my hair wet because I've just done it and I want to shoot more tomorrow. Um, so yeah, I may wear a hat with it, but I actually don't know if that makes it worse. It makes it worse. <laughs> the treatment that I got in the Brooks and Co Spa was a lymphatic drainage massage and it was so nice. It was really, really relaxing. Yeah, it was just such a beautiful treatment room. And we are going to go to the hot tubs now. Then we have dinner in Bonnie's, which is their restaurant. It's the most cozy weather we could have asked for. It is really chilly. It was snowing earlier. I actually got um, some lovely clips in the snow. It was so beautiful. Um, and yeah, it feels like a very, very cozy, cozy January little staycation. And I feel so lucky to be here. It also gives me a chance to catch up with Lauren and Jody, which is so nice. So yeah, we're gonna go to the hot tub now. two taps so apologies if this is crooked i have this um it's like a midi skirt dress from river island it's so handy the underneath is really nice and then i just have a cozy jumper on over it i think this is primer and then i have this coat oh you can see i've got this belted to like cinch it in and this coat this is from top shop i got it on ebay years ago and it is the best faux coat we had such a nice time in the hot tub but now we're gonna head for dinner and have a lovely cozy evening a fun trip it really was so so special and it always reminds me just how incredible Ireland is for staycations and not just in the summertime you can go on the most beautiful cozy winter staycations where you're not reliant on good weather and still have just the best time one of the things I wanted to do in this video is to kind of check in with you guys and ask you what kinds of videos you might like to see going forward so if there's something in particular that you'd like me to dedicate a video on if you'd like to do a Q&A or more videos on capsule wardrobe dressing or beauty or life style or anything like that, please do let me know in the comments. One of the questions that I've been getting recently over on my Instagram is about how I use the Dyson Era. If you'd like a more in-depth video on that, because I know things like that would probably be a full video, like how I style it from wet to dry products, how I keep the blow dry for a few days. I feel like there's enough for a whole video in that. So let me know if that's something you'd like to see. I actually had the pleasure of going in and doing my first Dyson demo with one of their product experts in the Dundrum Shopping Centre recently. And I got to try out their hair dryer, which I've never tried before. I'm going to insert some clips of that here because I was so impressed and I actually really want the hair dryer now. So right now I'm parked in Dundrum because I have a really fun appointment. I'm actually going into the Dyson zone. I think that's what it's called and or like the Dyson styling zone. And I'm going to be doing like a one on one styling appointment with one of their like uh, hairstylists. So they're going to show me exactly how to use some of their tools. I'm a massive Dyson fan. So I think today we are going to be using either the Corral or the hairdryer. I'll show you what I get up to. OK, let's go. Look at the beautiful blue color. I think this is their Christmas edition. It's so gorgeous. This is the exact one I have. I just love it do you so have much. That one, yeah. Do you like this big and bouncy or do you want to like wave? I love big and bouncy, okay. but why don't we try like a I red could do wave? Like a beachy wave? Yeah, because that's one that I don't really know who to yeah, do. So I would love that. Mm -hmm. Pick my section. And yeah. normally what I do is I just bring it around yeah. and then I just kind of let the straightness slide straight down. Ah. But when I get to the ends, I leave the ends in. Okay. So when you get to the ends, you leave the end in. Okay. So to literally, I know that looks really weird. No, but it But when you brush this all out and you have that more like a wave yeah. effect, it okay. looks really nice. I have never done that slide technique before. So you're twirling and then you slide. So you go in and you literally just yeah. twirl. Yeah. And then you're just sliding it down nice and slowly. Okay.
myself and Yosef, I did a really easy peanut satay noodles with chicken. Um, and I wanted to show you these bowls. I got them on Amazon. They're really deep and they're perfect for soups and things, but they're also great for noodle dishes. And they come with this little divot where you can rest your chopsticks on. And they also come with a uh, ramen spoon as well. So I'll link them below because they're so handy. I also wanted to give a little shout out to this gorgeous wine, La Celia. I was working with them in December and also in January. Honestly, guys, if you're looking for a nice red, this is under 10 euro a bottle and it is so delicious. Um, I'm not working with them on this vlog. I just wanted to give them a little mention, but look at our gorgeous little setup. I also adore these candles. These are also from Amazon. I'll link them below. They come in a pack of six. We were actually using the HelloFresh subscription service earlier in in January and it got me so back in the headspace for cooking because obviously being away for almost a month we had done no cooking so I'm absolutely loving being back cooking dishes at home. Yeah I really really want to take you guys along with me on all of the kind of wedding journey not just planning the wedding itself and like finding the dress and finding the ring but also I feel like it's a really good opportunity for me to double down on things like skincare and treatments and hopefully give myself like the best skin of my life like skin health and not just on the outside but like working on my nutrition my supplements and all that kind of stuff I feel like we should be taking the best care of ourselves anyway just for life in general but I feel like something like a wedding coming up is a really really nice like goal post to keep you motivated so yeah at the risk of rambling for very much longer in this video I will probably wrap it up here um, I hope you enjoyed seeing all of the different things I've been getting up to since I've been home and kind of giving you an insight into what's coming on this channel over the next you know few months and year but please as I mentioned do let me know in the comments if there's anything else that you'd like to see more of as always thank you so much for joining me I hope Hope you enjoyed watching and I will see you on my next one.